Hey everyone, it's Mona 63 Sonotech. I'm feeling a little bit better today, but I'm still coughing up God in the world out of the lungs. But anyway, I just wanted to do my um, <coughs> 15th and 30th video for Peggy and and Paige, who is uh, JP Peggy 2 and Stamp Girl. Um, this month we were supposed to do birthday cards and Christmas cards. Um, and so I did them both all at one time. And I want to show you them. Um, these are my favorite colors. Pink, green, yellow, and orange if it's in there. But it's not in here. But I mean, that's one of the four colors. Um, and so I bought this pattern paper at my local scrapbooking store. And um, this is a hard chipboard tag. Um, it says open the presents. And that was a theme on the paper I bought. I was going to use other paper, but I just fell in love with this. And I said, okay. And you open it up. And there's wishing you a very happy birthday. And basically, they're all the same. Uh, that stamped image on the inside is on all of them. And this one says, let's eat cake. It's got some baker's twine and a tag over there. Um, this is open the presents. Open the presents. I just love it. I thought, just beautiful colors. This one says, happy birthday. It's got um, a woody piece with some um, dimensional dots on it um, in the paper. And then this one is a doily with ribbon through the back. And I wanted to show you this because I want people to see, especially newbies that are out there, that even though people show perfect projects on film, sometimes they're not always perfect, like this one. I did not orientate myself before I started putting the paper on. So what I'll end up doing is cutting this off and putting it on another one. So... That's how you fix your fix your messes. So I just want to show people that. I thought it was hysterical. Now this, I'm hoping I can do this um, one-handed. So I wanted to make a Christmas mini album. And then I remembered I, I got to make Christmas cards. So I made, and this may have been done already on YouTube. God knows. I don't watch everybody's show videos, but um, I made a... How would you describe this? I don't even know. I wanted to make a mini album out of paper bags. These are paper bags. Um, but then I thought, oh, that's just too bulky. I don't know. I have the Bind It All. Um, is that what the thing's called? By Zutter? Um, you know, the bookmaking machine, which makes, um, to me, the uh, mini albums much cleaner. Um, but I just not, you know, I'm not feeling good, so I'm not really putting it forth effort. And I thought, well, i got to make cards. So what I'm going to use many these um little these are the um celebrate bags that you get um you know oh, let me see if i can find one real quick sorry about that y'all i'll look at my messy desk while i'm doing this these these are the um celebrate ones and the size on these are the i don't know the four by two by eights 12 packs and, you know, you just take one, you fold it over at the same body. So let me just show you it all around. Um, you know, it's folded, and there it is on the back. And I decided to put, um, I'm going to just show you one, because they're basically all the same. And then I'll show you all the um, overall detail. So um, it's folded over. I put tags inside, um, just different tags. So... Whoever sees this will have tags, number one, and you can journal on the back. So that's the pocket. This is just one of the cards from the journal. Plate. This is, um, it was the night before Christmas. I have held on to this since I was in Montana like three years ago, I think it was, two or three years ago. And I said, enough is enough, let it go. <laughs> so I made a belly band, put a little sticker piece from it. And then, the Christmas card part, this is hard to do with one hand, I knew this was going to be this way. Uh, I really need one of those things that mount. Inside the bag, inside the bag was the Christmas card. And this one is, says, um, it's just on blank cardstock, um, one of the journaling cards. And it's on a card and I have to do the inside. I haven't done the inside on those yet um, because all my Christmas stamps are at home. So it neatly, I say this with one hand, it neatly tucks back into the 
bag. And so not only are you getting a Christmas card, you're getting tags. You're getting a beautiful bag, okay? And you can put goodies inside here. So isn't that like the all-around overall good gift card gift to get? I don't know. I like it. So I'll just show you the fronts of the rest of them. Um, this one has a few more tags because this was such, this is a plain green um, paper. And I just belly banded it up, put a little tag on there, some tags on the inside, and the Christmas card is right there. Here's a red one. To me, this was the best Christmas line they've had. I know a lot of people will say, say others, but to me, this was absolutely the best one they had. And there's the card in that one. Here's another one, and the, the belly band went up a little. Let's move that down. There we go. And it is removable, so if you want to make your... But I did it for decoration. I think, you know, if you stuff... Even if you stuck, like, a gift card in there, or maybe a cute, few little things, it will, you still won't have to take off the belly band. And there's that. So those are my projects. My happy birthday cards and my Christmas cards slash mini bag. So there you go. I hope you guys like it. And uh, if you're out playing along with us, come on. It's not too late. We've got a whole year to go here. And I think making these ahead of time will save so much at the end. It's just wonderful. So thanks for letting me play Peggy and Paige. And I will see you next month. Bye.